but this is another amazing installation here at the uh, Olympic Plaza. This is, you can just about see in the background there, a kind of 360 degree rotating device into which people are seated and then thrown around this world in virtual reality. It's actually a kind of augmented reality installation. You can just about see here the space where you can see a track on which a train is, is chugging along. Uh, the train has a camera at the front of it and, uh, and your view within virtual reality is of that camera. So you find yourself in miniature form flying around this, uh, this kitchen. And it's a really creative way of bringing together full body virtual reality experiences with augmented content built into it. And uh, it's incredibly creative, but also incredibly sort of grounded in the everyday of our lives and getting us to see the world in a different way. And that's, for me, one of the essences of virtual reality at its best. It gets us to think about and experience the world differently. Over here, just getting started, we also have a virtual reality installation of snowboarding. So you can pretty much see these people getting ready to go. And again, another good example of VR at the Olympic Park. Um, I'm not sure how Sean White would do on this, but it looks, it looks kind of tricky. People are holding on for dear life by the looks of things. And, uh, and yeah, n another example of VR. Uh, and just finally here we have some robot fish going on, which you can pretty much see here, a game of hockey being played with robotic fish controlled by well, I guess a kind of drone-like control system, really. So this place is full of technology, and it's a, it's a showcase for the latest things that are out there, but also, really, the, um, to have the artist Namjoon Pike in the space is just a wonderful way of connecting the cutting edge of today's technology with someone who has pioneered media artwork, uh, both in Korea, but also in the world more widely. It's a fantastic example of bringing technology, art, culture, all into a space where Olympic sport is taking place. And uh, I've never seen anything like it before. There's also a full exhibition downstairs, a contemporary art exhibition, bringing together some of the greatest media artists. So, well done, Pyeongchang.